Now, with the ongoing angry exchanges between North and South Korea, Pyongyang has designated Seoul a quote-unquote hostile state. North Korea's National Assembly amended the constitution in line with their leader's vow to drop unification as a national goal. Pyongyang's military blasted sections of road and rail links with South Korea this week, describing it as a legitimate action against a hostile state. The South's military also fired warning shots south of the border in response to the North's detonations on roads and railways. 60-meter sections of the road and railway on the northern side of the border are now completely blocked as part of a phased, complete separation of its territory from the south. A satellite image appeared to show the road leading to the city in the north, torn with a large cache on the pavement and surrounding area. Experts believe that Kim Jong-un, the supreme leader of North Korea, has ordered to amend North Korea's constitution as a survival tactic. Pukani. I believe that North Korea's strategic goal of moving towards two hostile states is essentially Kim Jong-un's survival strategy. In other words, Kim Jong-un is saying, let's build a wall between two Koreas so we are not conscious of each other and each of us can survive on our own. South Korea's unification ministry that handles its ties with the North strongly condemned the characterization of a hostile state. The ministry further claimed that it will not waver in its efforts towards peaceful reunification. For all the latest news, download the Vyond app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.